Hello, my name is Hari Krishna Tanri. I'm a cardiac electrophysiologist at the Johns Hopkins Hospital. I specialize in ventricular arrhythmia ablations. I initially started my research career in a rare heart disease called arrhythmogenic right ventricular cardiomyopathy. It is a heart disease that affects young and healthy individuals who are very highly athletic. They develop arrhythmias from the lower chamber of the heart, and there's a high risk of sudden cardiac arrest. I spent my early research career in the diagnosis of this condition, but as time went along, we realized that many of these patients developed arrhythmias from the lower chamber of the heart, which required a special procedure called cardiac ablation, especially a procedure where you have to ablate on the outer surface of the heart. I developed this program at Johns Hopkins, and now we are a leading center in the world in, develop in ablation of the ventricular arrhythmias from the outer surface of the heart in this rare heart disease. My dad was a doctor and I always took him as a role model. And uh, all along, uh, throughout my uh, young adulthood, I always wanted to become a doctor. And I really fell in love with the profession in my medical school years. I was very passionate about taking care of patients. I, I enjoyed that human interaction. I always was a you know, people's person. I like interacting with patients. And as time went along, my interest in cardiology got stronger as I started working with more eminent cardiologists. I spent some time in Britain working with top eminent cardiologists there who again became my role models. And when I came to pursue my further education in the United States, I did research in cardiology, especially in cardiac electrophysiology at Johns Hopkins, which became the turning point of me choosing this as my ultimate place that what I actually want to spend the rest of my research career in. So I believe in educating you to take control of your own health and we will be on the site to assist you while you do that. This gives you more autonomy in how you deal with it. There are many patients of mine who uh, connect with me on a constant basis to get their questions answered, but most of all, they understand really well about what condition they have and when to go ask for medical help and when they can take care of things themselves. So it gives you a sense of empowerment, not helplessness, and to understand your problem or your condition better only gives you, puts you in a better position to take the right decisions and right choices down the road. What is unique about our program at Hopkins is that it is not a, your one chance to get your condition corrected or your questions answered, but it is a connection that you make with the Hopkins community. Patients travel several thousand miles to get here to visit us in our clinic and get an opinion from us, but what they get out of that is a connection back to our Hopkins community. Many of the patients travel back every year to come to our family conferences, not only to meet with other patients, but also to connect back with us. And that is something unique that we provide at Hopkins. It is not your one chance to get your questions answered, but it is a lifelong connection and a personal connection with the physicians at Hopkins.